Hello, hello, guys. Welcome back. Welcome back. How was your weekend? Hello, Freddy. How are you? Hello, Adrian. Excellent, excellent. Hello, Christian. Hello, how are you, teacher? Very good, very good. Ready, ready. Hello, Nerlin. Hello, Hiroki. How are you? Everybody doing I'm fine good? You? Very good, very good. It's Monday. Are you ready for your English class? How was your weekend? Of course. Excellent. Okay. What did you do? Very nice. Working. working very hard. Good, good. Okay. ¿Cómo se diría, teacher? Como así como eh, me tocó trabajar duro, me tocó, no sé si se, se interpreta oh. en el inglés. ¿no? Yes, yes. Uh, you can say, you can say something like, I had to work this weekend. I had to work this weekend. Oh, eso es como estuve trabajando, creo. Estuve o trabajé duro esta semana. Trabajé esta semana, algo así. That is correct. I had oh. to work this weekend. That's or you could say, I had to work hard this weekend. All right. Uh, who can tell me what information do you remember about the materials that we were looking at last week? What do you remember from last week's class? What topics do you remember? Daniel Gato. Yes. Oui. What topics do you remember from the previous class? From the last eh, class. De los infinitivos, creo. Infinitives, okay. Can you give me an example? Eh, no, más o menos recuerdo que era como, como agregarle tú, por ejemplo, to get, o algo así. Mm -hmm, mm -hmm. Or you can say, for example... About health problems? Health problems. Eso iba a decir, eso es lo que le iba a decir en español. <laughs> de de uh -huh. problemas de salud, ya me acordé. Yes, health problems. That is correct. Right? For example, you say it is healthy. It is healthy to drink water. It is important to sleep six hours. Right? Or whatever the case may be. So in the previous class, we were analyzing the infinitive structures. So today we are going to go ahead and start section number three. In this session, participants will listen to a conversation between two people deciding where to go for dinner. Words such as so, to, neither, and either will be introduced. En esta clase, los participantes escucharán una conversación entre dos personas diciendo, decidiendo dónde ir a cenar. Palabras como entonces, también, y tampoco serán presentadas. Listen, please. Listen to the audio, please. Hi, welcome to another section. This time, we will teach you words of agreements. Please copy the following words in your notes. So, to, neither, either. Listen and practice. Say, would you like to go out to dinner tonight? Sure. Where do you want to go? Well, what do you think of Indian food? I love it, but I'm not really in the mood for it today. Yeah, I'm not either, I guess. It's a bit spicy. Hmm, how do you like Japanese food? Oh, I like it a lot. I do too. And I know a nice Japanese restaurant near here. It's called Aroha. Oh, I've always wanted to go there. Terrific. Let's go. 
Did you notice how they use either and to in the dialogue? Excellent. Now what I want you to do is to practice the conversation with a friend. What? I do too. All right. I would like for everybody to look at the vocabulary in this conversation. And I would like for you to please uh, analyze this vocabulary. And if you see any words that you don't know or any words that you are not familiar with that you would like for me to explain in detail, please raise your hand. Anybody question? Anybody question? No. Questions about the vocabulary? Uh, yes, about what is mood? Eh, mood, mood. Eh, mood es como tu sentido de humor. Él dice, I am not in the mood for Indian food. No estoy de humor para comer comida india. Thanks. Yes. Another question? Another question? No? Okay. Now we're going to listen no. and no. practice. Listen and practice. Say, would you like to go out to dinner tonight? Say, everybody listen hey, and repeat. Would you like to go Say, out? would you like to go out to dinner tonight? Mm. Say, Say would you like to go out to dinner tonight? Sure. Where do you want to go? Sure. sure. Where do you, where want, do to you go? want to go? Well, what do you think of Indian food? Well, what do you think of Indian food? I love it. I love, I love it. it. I love it. But I'm not really in the mood for it today. But, but I'm, I'm not, not really in the mood, mood for, for it today. today. Yeah, I'm not either. Yeah, yeah I'm, I'm not, not either. either. I guess it's a bit spicy. I guess it's, it's a, a bit, bit spicy. spicy. Hmm, how do you like Japanese food? Hmm, how, how do, you do you like, like Japanese, Japanese food? food? Oh, I like it a lot. Oh, oh, oh I, like I, like, it a lot. I like it a lot. I do too. I do too. I do too. I do and too. I know a nice Japanese restaurant near here. I know a um, nice Japanese, Japanese restaurant near here. It's called Iroha. It's On called Iroha. Iroha. Oh, I've always wanted to go there. Oh, oh I've always, I've always wanted, wanted to go, wanted with, to to go, go there. there. Terrific. Let's go. Terrific. Terrific. Let's go. Let's go. Okay. Uh, any questions about this yeah, vocabulary? Uh, yeah. What is terrific? Terrific. Ah, terrific. Es como excelente. Vamos. Let's go. Terrific is oh. excellent. Fantastic. <clears throat> Wonderful. <clears throat> Teacher, yo tengo una pregunta también. Yeah. En la parte donde eh, dice eh, Bob hace la pregunta, how do you like Japanese food? Y Jeff dice, oh, I like it a lot. Y después ah. responde, I do. ¿Qué significa el I do too? Ahí, porque... I do too es yo también. I like it a lot. Es como el me too. Si tú dices me too, o I do too, es a mí también. Oh, es lo mismo. Es lo mismo. Me too, I do too. Me too, I do too, es lo mismo. Es más formal alguno que otro, o es... Uh, no, no, you could no. use either or, mm -hmm. okay. Which, whichever you. you want to use. Okay, 
Thank you. Sure. Yes. Sobre la misma pregunta del compañero, este, yo quiero saber si el I do se convierte en me. Eh, no necesariamente que se convierte. Puedes o solo usar... las frases lo que hace. Ajá, puedes, puedes usar okay. cualquiera de los dos. Si tú quieres decir, por ejemplo, alguien te dice, en eh, my case, I say, I like pupusas. And then you say, a mí también, me too. O quieres decir, yo también, I do too. O me too, it's the, it's the same thing. You can use either or. It just depends uh, what you want to use. Gracias. Mm -hmm. Okay, guys, now we are going to practice. We're going to work in pairs. And I want you to practice the conversation as many times as possible. Van a tener cinco minutos y quiero que practiquen la conversación las veces que pueda. In five minutes. Any questions? Any questions? Not for me. Okay. Hola. Miguel. Hola. Hola. Hola, hola. Practicamos Mucha. la conversación. Ay. Lindy. No, no hay nadie aquí, teacher. I think Lindy has uh, internet connection issues. Let's go, let's yeah. put Iris in here. Okay. There is Iris. I understand. Uh, Glendy. Okay. Uh, we practice. Mm. Hi. Hi, Miguel. Hi. Good evening. Good evening. Practice uh, the vocabulary? Yeah. Yeah. Okay. Uh, I start. Uh, say, okay. would you like to go out to dinner tonight? Sure. Where do you want to go? Well, what do you think of Indian food? I love it, but I am not really in the mood for it today. Yeah, I know either. I guess it's a bit spicy. How do you how how do you like Japanese food? Oh, I like it a lot. I do too. I I know a nice Japanese restaurant near here. It's called Aroa. Oh, I always wanted to go there. Terrific. Let's go. Okay. Uh, change the world, please. <laughs> <laughs> okay. Uh, no sé si yeah. quiere yeah. Iris practicar. Ah, oh, okay. O practican yeah. ustedes dos o Ay, no sé. Iris, do you want practice? Yes, yes, pero no veo. Okay. Oh. Okay. No veo, no me puedo conectar, por Dios. Ah. My, good, my goodness. Ay, <ríe> ah. Por el grupo enviaron la, oh, el screenshot de la pero, conversación. Yo puedo compartir. Ah, sí, Creo que ya están viendo, ¿no? Sí. You want to see? Yeah. Okay. Okay. Yeah. Okay. Yeah. Okay. Yeah. Okay. Um, it is. La cosa. It is. You want to see Jeff? Aquí soy yo. Yo. Okay. 
Uh, bow. Yeah, you go. Okay. Say, okay. would you like to go out to dinner tonight? Sure. Where do you want to go? Well, what do you think of India food? I love you, it, but I am not really in the mood for it today. Yeah, I not either. I guess it's very, it's a bit spicy. It's a bit spicy. Um, how do you like Japanese food? Oh, I, I like it a lot. I do too, and um, I am not nice Japanese restaurant near here. It's called Airoja. Oh, I always wait, waiting. Wait, ¿Cómo, cómo se, ¿alguien sabe cómo se pronuncia el waiting o wait? Wanted. 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 O, o wanted. Wanted. Ok, ahorita lo busco, no me acuerdo. Wanted. 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 Quantum. <clears throat> That's it. Yeah. Yeah. Okay. Uh, uh, si comparamos... Yeah. Si no, 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 por mí no hay problema. Yo tengo, uh, enviaron la captura al grupo. Aquí ah, puedo ver. Ok. Ok. Hoy yo yes. soy bot. Ok. Espera, dame un. Give me a second. Dale, dale. dale Pongo otra vez el video. Porque de ahí lo veo yo. <ríe> dale, no problema. Uy, se va a caer. Cuidado. Ok, ¿qué vas, quién, ¿quién va a hacer hoy? ¿Quién es? Ay, I'm bot. Ok, chido, ahorita. Ok. Um, say, I will you like to go out to dinner tonight? Sure, where do you want to go? Well, what do you think of India food? I love it, but I'm not really in the mood for, for it today. Yeah, I'm not either. I guess it 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 is a very space. Uh, how do you like Japanese food? Oh, I like it a lot. I do too, and I know a nice Japanese restaurant near here. It's called called uh Iroha. Oh, I'll always wait, waiting, waiting, waiting. <laughs> Va a practicar usted. Hola. Va a sí, practicar. Sí, sí. Ok. Me gustaría. Hola. Me gustaría leer. Ahorita. Es la conversación de WhatsApp, ¿verdad? Uh -huh. um, Say, would you like to go out to dinner tonight? Sure. Where do you want to go? Well, what do you think of Indian food? I love it, 
but I'm not really in the mood for it today. Yeah, I'm not either. I guess it's a bit spicy. A bit spicy. Mm -hmm. How do you like Japanese food? Oh, I like I like it a lot. I do too, and I know I a nice Japanese restaurant near here. It's called Iroha. Oh, I uh, I always want to go there. Terrific! Let's go. Who say a practical Carla? La, la, ¿cómo se llama? La diapositiva que subió el teacher al, al chat. Sí. Dijiste que no. Ah, pues entonces ahí sería con no, el compañero. Pero creo que tar, tartamudeo o algo, creo. No, pues sí, pero eso se trata de practicarlo. Entonces, <ríe> ajá. Vaya, pues, ¿con quién? Si quiere, en, en con Ricardo. Yo voy a hacer el segundo. Uh -huh. eh, permítanme... Hola, ¿cómo fue? Hola. Hola, dígame. Hola, hola. Aquí estoy. Bueno, si quiere, empiece usted, entonces. Eh, Jeff, yo seré Jeff. Sí. Say, would you, would you like to go out to dinner tonight? Sure, where do you want to go? Well, eh, what do you think? of Indian food. I love it, but I'm not really in the in the mood for it today. Yeah. I'm not either. I guess it's a bit it's a bit spicy. Mm, how do you like Japanese food? Oh, I like it. Oh, I like it a lot. I do too and I I I know a nice Japanese restaurant near here. It's calling y y cómo se dice y yo creo que se diría Iroha. 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 It's Iroha. Oh, I love always wanted to go there. Terrific. Let's go. Okay. Durante lo... Bueno, yo me acabo de conectar, compañeros. Sí, yo nomás me conecté, me salió redireccionado a un, a una, a un cuarto. Yo estaba... No, estaba por la empezar la a con el otro grupo cuando me caí esta notificación, así que vine. ¿Cómo? ¿Usted? ¿Pero usted de este grupo? De... En... Say, would you like to go out for dinner tonight? Sure, where do you want to go? Well, what do you think about Indian food? I love it, but I'm not really in the mood for it today. Yeah, I'm not either, I guess. It's a bit too spicy. Mm, who do you like Japanese food? Oh, I like it a lot. I do too, and I know a nice Japanese restaurant near there, near her. It's a kind of Iroha. Oh, I've always wanted to go there. Terrific, let's go. Excellent, excellent. All right, Freddie, select somebody. David, select somebody. Okay, um, Andrea Esmeralda. Andrea. And Lisbeth Martinez. Lisbeth Martinez. All right, Lisbeth Martinez and Andrea. Uh, Lisbeth, you're going to be, uh, Lisbeth is going to be Jeff. Andrea is going to be Bob. Okay, teacher, um, 
¿Me puede compartir el, el enlace? Está en el chat de WhatsApp. Espérenme, ya lo busco. Ya lo... Ok. Action. I'm Jeff. Yes, you can be Jeff. Okay, say what well, you like to go out to dinner tonight. Sure. Where do you want to go? Well, what do you think of Indian food? I love it, but I'm not really in the food in the mood for in today. Yeah, I'm not either. I guess it's a bit spicy. Mm, how do you like Japanese food? Oh, I like it a lot. I do too. And I know I, a nice Japanese restaurant near, near here. It's called Carl um, Iron, Iroa. Oh, I always wanted to go there. Terrific. Let's go. All right, perfect, perfect. Okay, guys, now I'm going to take the attendance. When I call your name, please say present. When I call your name, please say present. Are you ready? Ready. Yeah. Yes. All right, let me have the first participant. Let me have the first participant is uh, Adriana. Present. So Present. Present, good. Thank you. Uh, Andrea. Here. Okay. Uh, Carlos William. Carlos William. Is absent. Carlos William is absent. Is absent. Okay. Yeah, let me have Cesar Alexander. Present teacher. Okay. Yeah, Cesar Alexander Christian Oswaldo. Present teacher. Okay. Claudia Jocelyn. Present. Okay. David Alonso. Present. Freddy Jose. Present, sir. Okay. Glendy Eliseth. Glendy Eliseth. Absent. Okay. Uh, Iris Janet. Present. Okay. Uh, Irving Iroki. Present teacher. Okay. Jonathan Vladimir Salinas. Mm. Present. Present. All right. Josue Miguel. Present. Carla Tatiana. Present. Catherine Jasmine. Present. Lizbeth Martinez. Present teacher. All right. Luisa Ariana. Present. Luz Virginia. Present. Mayra Patricia. Mayra Patricia. Absent. Okay. Melissa Guadalupe. Melissa Guadalupe. Absent. Nerling Haciel. 
Nerlin Hasial. Absent. Ricardo Fabricio. I'm here, teacher. Okay. Yancy Yamilat. Yancy Yamilat. Absent. Okay. A lot of people absent today. Okay. Uh, now, what you are going to. Hi. Hi. Revise, revise el chat porque ya hay varios que le dijeron presente en el chat. Oh, really? Yeah. Ah, okay. Yeah, Glendy Flores, teacher, I came here well. I hope talk to my internet. Okay. So that's Glendy. Okay. Glendy is present. Okay. Let's start. Lendy present. ¿Qué más? ¿Pudo escucharme, teacher, Carla? Yes, Carla Tatiana, I can hear you. Eh, Nerlin is present. Nerlin is present. Eh, let me see. Nerlin. Nerlin is present. Nerlin. Okay. Solo esos tres eran. That's it. Okay. And what's up? Nada. Okay. All right. Now, for this activity, guys, what you're going to do is you are going to come over here and you're going to write a similar conversation. Va a escribir una conversación similar over here in the discussion box. You will have five minutes to prepare the conversation with your classmates. Uh, yes, Carla, do you have a question? Sí, pero no es referente a la actividad, solamente una pregunta. ¿Qué edición es la que están utilizando del interchange? Teacher. Oh, I, I don't know. I really don't know. Bueno, gracias. Yeah. Uh, teacher, uh, in like, uh, Oh, right now. Three, uh, right? Yes, right now we are on section number 3.1. Uh, conversation. Okay. I get it. Okay. All right, you will have five minutes to prepare your discussion. Ready? Let's go. Hola. Eh, Cesar, Christian, Luz. I'm here, teacher. Yes, teacher. All right, work together, work together. Okay. Trabajen juntos. Okay, eh, compañeros. Era de, de la sección 3.1, ¿verdad? No más que para ser sincero, si no, no entendí que había que hacer ahí donde se añade la, la publicación. La conversación. Hacer una conversación similar a la que hemos estado practicando. 
Ok, pero sí, como que hay que hacerlo en grupo o cada quien no va a ser individual y solo nos pasaron a la sala para, para ayudarnos. El grupo tiene que ser entre los tres. Como dice compañera, se le escucha un poco suave. Ah, entre los tres. Oh, entiendo, entiendo. Bueno, voy a la plataforma ahorita. Porque también lo podemos avanzar en, en, en nuestro notebook y después la subimos a la plataforma, pero ahí. Pero ¿Cómo, ¿qué vamos a trabajar los tres? ¿Cómo se llamaría el título? Eh. Go, going out for dinner. Ok. Going at, out for dinner, ¿verdad? Yes. Okay. Eh, ¿Cómo se les ocurre que podría ser? Pondremos nuestro nombre o algo así, o inventamos, puede ser Tommy. Puede hacerlo ya personalizado. Ah, ok. Eh, digamos, usted hace el suyo y el mío y compartimos ideas o, o algo así. Sí, yo, soy Contreras. yo diría que vamos línea en línea ahorita. Ajá, sí. Empezar, que no. Una línea. C. Empieza aquí. Entiendo. Termina final. Por ejemplo, preguntar, eh, would you like eh, eh, out eh, dinner eh, eat pupusas, por ejemplo? Hola. Digamos que, no sé si ven, no sé si ven. Pero se ve un rectángulo blanco. Ah, es, que, es, lo, es que estoy en, en, la, en la plataforma mía, entonces, porque la verdad le, creo que lo he entendido menos que ustedes. Te gustaría ir a... Ajá, entonces, digamos, sería así como tu yo, like, este... To go out. It, to dinner. To dinner. Ah, digamos, como te gusta, te gusta o te gustaría salir a comer pupusas, algo así, a cenar pupusas. Ah, uh -huh. yes. Okay. ¿A dónde te gustaría ir a comer? Entonces sería would you like, ¿verdad? Ajá. Uh -huh. Would you like? Would you like? To dinner. Tonight or tomorrow, for example, mañana. Okay. Would you put it here? Tomorrow, for example. To go to out to dinner. To go to dinner. To go to dinner. To dinner today. To dinner today. Okay, tomorrow. Yes. Tomorrow? Yes. 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 Le pregunta a dónde le gustaría ir. Would you, where do you want to go? Where, uh, sí. Well, I want to go to the hospital. <laughs> Creo que lo manejan mejor ustedes. <laughs> uh, no le vamos a poner como. Como el nombre de quien no pregunta o algo así. 
Uh, no. O oh, sí, invéntelo. Y esto lo tomaríamos como, como segunda pregunta o sería así como que la misma persona lo preguntó, digamos, así. Una. Hay una, una, una pregunta o pregunta a otra persona. Por ejemplo, la primera, would you like to go dinner tomorrow? Por uh -huh. ejemplo. Sure, where do you want to go? Le, le responde. Y de ahí el, ah, el primero sería... le vuelve a Llevaría Shure entonces, así digamos. Um, sí. Ah, ok, seguro. sí, queda bien, sure. queda bien. Significa Shure. Shure. Es como, ¿seguro dónde te gustaría ir? Sí. ¿O dónde bueno. quieres ir, digamos? Yeah. Eh, digamos, eh, me gustaría ir... Al, ¿Qué se les ocurre? La Pampa. ¿Cómo? O a la esquina, no sé, ahí al, al, o al parque. A Holocuilta. Oh, sí, <ríe> buenísimo. A mi casa. ¿Dónde sería? Uh, do you think of pupusas? Uh, do you think eat pupusas? Así, I would like to go to do you think o cómo? Sería, what do you think? ¿Qué piensas de comer pupusas? What do you think of eat pupusas? Okay. O digamos, about pupusas. About significa como acerca de o, o de pupusas. Yeah. Sería bueno así como... Eh, yes... I love the pupusas. Me, sí, me encantan las pupusas. Yes, I love it. Eat pupusas very much. Okay. Algo así. Ok. ¿En delicioso? Yes. ¿Así? No sé si queda bien así. ¿no? <risa> Repeat, please, compañero. Eh, que no sé si queda bien el signo de, de, no me acuerdo, de admiración, no. O oh, lo quito. Eso. Cuando son, cuando, que son delicious, sí. Si es pregunta, oh. sería inter... Eh... Como esta sería una respuesta, ¿verdad? Sí, me encanta la pupusa. Yes. Yes, I love it. That's delicious. ¿Así? Yes. Sí, queda bien. Sí, yeah. eh, bueno, poner como... Uy, uy, uy. No, no le ponemos así como un nombre... Para distinguir no, ahora ponemos una... ya más o menos de a dónde vamos a ir, si a los planes o los cuiltas de Eat Restaurant, de, perdón, oh. Pupusa Restaurant. Ajá. No sé si quedaría bien a, así. Muy bien, podemos ir a Olocuilta. Go to Olocuilta City. Oh, sí, ¿eh? quedaría bien. Así como. 
Muy bien, podemos ir a lo oculta. Sí, ¿qué dices? Eh, where to go to a lo oculta city? Es como, como afirmando, porque si, le, si fuera así como, como modal, como pregunta, sería may, may I go to, sería como más formal. Pero así es como estar afirmando, sí, podemos ir a lo que te decir. ¿Qué dices? Ajá. Yes, I, eh, where, where to go a Mamachu's restaurant. Huh? Yes, I. En, perdón, yeah, no. we, ah, we, we, sería en, en gol, en, en, en plural. ¿Sí? Así, ¿verdad? ¿Cómo dijo? Eh, así como, sí. ¿Mm? Ah, pero era así como... Right, let me have two volunteers. Let me have two volunteers to read the conversation. Hi, teacher. All right, Jonathan, who is your partner? Uh, my partner. Yo. Ah, está Luisa. No la había visto. Okay, Luisa and Jonathan. Action. Uh, one second, please. Aquí está. Uh, what, what do you like to eat out? Sure. Where do you want to go? Well, what do you think about Mexican food? I don't like spicy food. Mm, how do you like Salvadorian food? Yes. I love it. I want to eat pupusas. I do too. I love Salvadorian food, but I will eat tamales. <laughs> it, it's only some chicken tamales. <laughs> chicken tamales. <Yes. laughs> okay, good, good. All right, awesome. Elisa and Jonathan, good pronunciation. Thank you. Uh, let me have Thank you, teacher. another volunteer, another pair. That was Luisa and Jonathan. Who else wants to participate? Okay, Claudia, who's your partner? Hey, Claudia, who is your partner? Okay, uh, con Andrea. Okay, Andrea and Clark. Yes, coach. Ahorita vamos a leer. La composición. Okay. Yes, that is correct. Empiezo yo, Andrea. Sí, está bien. Okay. What would you like to go out to dinner tonight? Sure. Where do you want to go? Disculpe. Me escuché bien. Hoy sí me escucha. Ajá. No, o sea, no entendí la pregunta. Pero estamos leyendo, ¿verdad? 
Ajá, la conversación que escribimos. Ah, ok. <risa> este, let's go restaurant, Sara es. <risa> well, the restaurant is that near here? Yes, it is very near. Oh, let's go. Ok, let's go. Ok, what do you like eat in the restaurant? I don't know. Uh, it's good food. Yes, it's very good. Uh, hasta ahí quedamos awesome. con la yes. All right, excellent. Excellent work. All right, thank you. And let me have two more volunteers. Cesar, who was your partner? Cesar, who was your partner? Okay, we lost Cesar. Freddy, who was your partner? I know Freddy already participated. Lisa. Yeah, usted, usted participó. Thank you. Okay. Let me have um, Iroki, who was your partner? Yeah. Um, who, who was your partner? Miguel. Okay, Miguel and Iroki, action. Ok, Miguel, yo soy Freddy. <laughs> ok. <laughs> Let's go. Um, hello. Hello. How are you? <laughs> the conversation in the... Yeah, um, I will, I will, you like to go out lunch? Sure. Where do you want to go? Well, that... Do you think of Salvadoran food? I like it, but I want to eat another kind. Mm, yeah, I want to kind of restaurant. Do you like to go? I would like to go Mexican food. Yeah, let's go. Um, let's go. Mama That's Chus. <laughs> All right, good, good, <laughs> excellent work. Good job. Okay, guys, uh, at this moment, do you have any questions in regards to this exercise? Not for me, teacher. Okay. Now, what I would like for us to do is we're going to move forward. Uh, if you didn't finish, that's going to be your homework. We're going to look at the next one of uh, words. So, to neither and either. Listen, please. Agreement words? Very good. Now we'll teach you when to use each. Try to make sense of what you see on the following chart. Don't go as we we'll walk you through the use of so, to, neither, either, and more examples. So, to, neither, either. I like Japanese food a lot. So do I. I do too. Really? I don't like it very much. I'm crazy about dessert. So am I. I am too. Oh, I'm not. I can eat really spicy food. So can I. I can too. Really? I can't. I don't like greasy food. Neither do I. I don't either. Oh, I like it a lot. I'm not in the mood for Indian food. Neither am I. I'm not either. Really? I am. I can't stand fast food. Neither can I. I can't either. Oh, I love it. The use of to and so to agree with something being said to us. In English, we can use to or so in short answers to show we agree with something or someone. Notice we use the auxiliary verb of the short answer of the statement being said to us. For example, I am hungry. I am too. So am I. I love apple pie. I do too. So do I. I can play chess. I can too. So can I. The position of two is right at the end. Follow me. Subject, auxiliary, two. The position of so is right at the beginning. Follow me again. 
So, auxiliary plus subject. Now let's study the use of neither and either. To show agreement with negative statements, we can use neither and either. We also use the auxiliary verb of the short answer of the statement. Pay attention to the following. We use the negative auxiliary when we use either and the positive auxiliary with either. Follow the examples. I am not hungry. I am not either. Neither am I. I don't dance salsa. I don't either. Neither do I. I can't swim. I can't either. Neither can I. I'll leave you with the formula so you understand it better. Subject plus negative auxiliary plus either. Notice either goes at the end. Neither plus positive auxiliary plus subject. Notice neither goes at the beginning. Please agree with me in the following statements. Write your responses on our discussion box. I like ice cream. I am happy. I love pizza. I can't swim. I don't like French. Hi, did you copy the agreement words? Very good. Now we'll teach you when to use each. Try to make sense of what you see on the following chart. Don't go as we'll walk you through the use of so, too, neither, either, and more examples. So, too, neither, either. I like Japanese food a lot. So do I. I do too. Really? I don't like it very much. I'm crazy about dessert. So am I. I am too. Oh, I'm not. I can eat really spicy food. So can I. I can too. Really? I can't. I don't like greasy food. Neither do I. I don't either. Oh, I like it a lot. I'm not in the mood for Indian food. Neither am I. I'm not either. Really? I am. I can't stand fast food. Neither can I. I can't either. Oh, I love it. The use of to and so to agree with something being said to us. In English, we can use to or so in short answers to show we agree with something or someone. Notice we use the auxiliary verb of the short answer of the statement being said to us. For example, I am hungry. I am too. So am I. I love apple pie. I do too. So do I. I can play chess. I can too. So can I. The position of two is right at the end. Follow me. Subject, auxiliary, two. The position of so is right at the beginning. Follow me again. So, auxiliary plus subject. Now let's study the use of neither and either. To show agreement with negative statements, we can use neither and either. We also use the auxiliary verb of the short answer of the statement. Pay attention to the following. We use the negative auxiliary when we use either and the positive auxiliary with either. Follow the examples. I am not hungry. I am not either. Neither am I. I don't dance salsa. I don't either. Neither do I. I can't swim. I can't either. Neither can I. I'll leave you with the formula so you understand it better. Subject plus negative auxiliary plus either. Notice either goes at the end. Neither plus positive auxiliary plus subject. Notice neither goes at the beginning. Please agree with me in the following statements. Write your responses on our discussion box. I like ice cream. I am happy. I love pizza. I can't swim. I don't like French. Okay, guys, we're going to go ahead and stop right here. It's already time to go. 
I would like for you guys to please continue working on the exercises and we will see you guys tomorrow. Good night, guys. Bye-bye. Good night, everyone. See you. All right. Bye-bye.